WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update. And currently have all the U.S. indices that we track as well as all the sectors with inside the S&P 500 trading to the upside. Dow's up 330 points. That's 1%. One in seven tenths for the S&P or 64 points. Two and a half percent for the NASDAQ. 100, uh, A little over 2% for the Russell. A little over 3% for the semis. They're trading up 81 bucks. Gold is up four bucks. Silver's up 25 cents. Light sweet crude is the Debbie Downer. It's off a buck 30. That's down one in seven tenths percent. An even bigger downer is natural gas, up another 5%, down 24 pennies, trade out of 443. And the 30-year treasury up nine ticks, 125.06 is the print there. Let's go take a look at our nine panel market update chart. Let's do this. Let's go switch over to my white background nine panel market update chart. Just a tad different here, but it's going to provide us with a lot of good information out here. If we take a look at the ES Mini, <clears throat> right now it is trading below it's red oscillator and change line. That is very likely the price target on a move higher that should last through the end of tomorrow. 38.98 in that area is its target. If we take a look at the spot volatility index, well, it is, well, actually, I don't have that. The NQ. Let's talk about the NQ. The NQ yesterday forming bar number nine of a TD9 count. We've got a TD9 count bottom in place. We should expect and anticipate a counter trend move. That counter trend move should take us up in the 11,173 or 11,302 area. 11,302 is the more likely spot. The Dow, Dow equity future contract has simply been consolidating with inside its profile. It does have a Rhodes momentum indicator top out there, but just a consolidation pattern going on. Natural or high grade copper, it's got uh, two different TD9 count tops out here that has just simply led to a sideways move with inside its profile. Goldilocks has got a couple different Rhodes momentum indicator tops. The price is above the top of its daily profile, and therefore its overall signal is neutral. Silver has a couple of Rhodes momentum indicator tops as well, with price consolidating with inside its profile. Light Street Crude yesterday confirmed a sell the D point pattern, otherwise a Gartley sell pattern. Now, price should go target its oscillator and change line. That oscillator and change line currently printed at 76.14. We take a look at what's next up here. Natural gas. Here's natural gas. So natural gas trading down 5% today off 24 pennies. But what it's also going to do, it's going to confirm a TD9 count bottom pattern today and complete that pattern tomorrow. And a 30-year treasury for a bar number eight of a TD9 count. That could identify a TD9 count bottom as well between tomorrow and Tuesday of next week. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Edge Show, but if you have to start your Thursday, please have a terrific one. We'll look forward to speaking to you again soon. Take care.